Hello, this is Timeless Mission Music Ministry, and I come to you today because I want to continue sharing in the Word. Now today I'll be coming from 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 29 through 58 of the King James Version of the Bible. Else, what shall they do which are baptized for the dead? If the dead rise not at all, why are they then baptized for the dead? And why stand we in jeopardy every hour? I protest by your rejoicing, which I have in Christ Jesus our Lord. I die daily, if after the manner of men I have fought with beast of beasts at Ephesus, with advantages it meet, if the dead rise not, let us eat and drink, for tomorrow we die. Be not deceived. Evil communications corrupt good manners. Awake to righteousness, and sin not, for some have not the knowledge of God. I speak this to your shame, for some man will say, How are the dead raised up, and with what body do they come? Thou fool, that which thou sowest is not quickened, except it die, and that which thou sowest, thou sowest not that body that shall be but bare grain it may chance of wheat or of some other grain but god giveth it a body as it has pleased him and to every seed his own body all flesh is not the same flesh but there is one kind of flesh of men another flesh of beasts another of fishes and another of birds there are also celestial bodies and bodies terrestrial, but the glory of the celestial is one, and the glory of the terrestrial is another. There is one glory of the sun, and another glory of the moon, and another glory of the stars, for one star differs from another star in glory. So also is the resurrection of the dead. It is sown in corruption it is raised in in corruption it is sown in dishonor it is raised in glory it is sown in weakness it is raised in power it is sown a natural body it is raised a spiritual body there is a natural body and there is a spiritual body and so it is written the first man adam was made a living soul the last adam was made a quickening spirit. How about that was not first which is spiritual, but that which is natural, and afterward that which is spiritual. The first man is of the earth, earthy. The second man is the Lord from heaven. As is the earthy, such are they also that are earthy. And as is the heavenly, such are they also that are heavenly and as we have borne the image of the earthy we shall also bear the image of the heavenly now this i say brethren that flesh and blood cannot inherit the kingdom of god neither does corruption inherit in corruption behold i show you a mystery we shall not all sleep but we shall all be changed in a moment, in the twinkling of an eye, at the last trump, for the trumpet shall sound, and the dead shall be raised incorruptible, and we shall be changed. For this corruptible must put on incorruption, and this mortal must put on immortality. So when this incorruptible shall have put on incorruption, and this mortal shall have put on immortality then shall be brought to pass the saying that is written death is swallowed up in victory o death where is thy sting o grave where is thy victory the sting of death is sin and the strength of sin is the law but thanks be to god which gives us the victory through our lord jesus christ therefore my beloved brethren, 
Be ye steadfast, unmovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord, for as much as ye know that your labor is not in vain in the Lord. Now that was 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 29 through 58 of the King James Version of the Bible. And may it continue to build the spirit man within, and may God continue to get all of the glory. Jesus' name, amen.